Hello, welcome to Movie Musters. Power Book IV, Force, classifying the influential figures in power, powder, respect. Tagged. An incredible tenth and final episode of Tommy Egan's season has finally concluded Power Book IV, Force's second season. It was time for Tommy and Diamond to take CBI to the next level and establish themselves as the best connection in Chicago this week. But before they could accomplish that, Tommy and Diamond had some things to clear up. Vic Flynn, who Tommy found to be the CBI rat giving information to the authorities, is where we begin. Tommy deceives Vic about the location of a meet in order to make sure Vic can't report him to the police. Vic is duped by Tommy regarding a meeting spot, which throws off the FBI's scheme to apprehend Tommy. On the other hand, they lose yet another officer and gain Claudia, Murkovic, and the Serbs. Vic is put in danger when he discovers that Tommy gave him the incorrect address for the meeting because he is aware that Tommy is collaborating with the FBI. The attempt to save Vic before he might be killed is made in the last moments of the episode, but we won't know if it is successful until season 3. Tommy and Diamond's next task is to avoid Miguel and his crazy prince's group. Miguel can now clearly see that Tommy is vying for his position, and his only option is to murder Tommy. In an attempt to accomplish this, Miguel dispatches his associate Nasi, but Tommy intervenes to defend himself and ends up killing Nasi. He successfully eludes Miguel and his group, and Tommy and Diamond meet with Chi to offer him a position directly beneath him at Cartel. Despite their first plan to force Miguel away, Chi lets CBI take over the Serbs' position as a result of Murkovic and his team's imprisonment. Miguel, Tommy, and Diamond are given strong instructions by Chi to compete in good health and not to take any kind of revenge. Even though they both agree, Miguel takes the initiative to confront Chi by removing Myria from Tommy as soon as he finds out about their connection. The reappearance of D-Mac, who is determined to rejoin CBI in spite of Tommy and Diamond's objections, occurs elsewhere in the episode. As a favor for Diamond, D-Mac goes out of his way to kill Mad Dog, the teenage killer of Leon, in an effort to win their favor. The fact that Mad Dog is the nephew of King Kilo, a pivotal figure in the alliance the CBI established around Chicago, complicates matters. Fortunately, Jenard assists King Kilo in reaching a compromise so that he refrains from taking revenge against
Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.